Today, it would be almost impossible to confuse a mammal with a reptile. Deer simply aren't like snakes. Dogs simply aren't like crocodiles. Rodents simply aren't like turtles. However, in the mid-Triassic period, it is almost impossible to distinguish between the advanced cynodonts and the early mammals. They were virtually indistinguishable, and in order to distinguish between them, you would have to look at their teeth, at a groove in the lower jaw, and very tiny features. These animals had developed a level of similarity uh, to the point where even the experts uh, can argue as to where uh, we should draw the line between reptile and mammal. So, from the mid-Carboniferous period to the middle of the Triassic, there was a slow, gradual series of transitions as uh, primitive pelicosaurs became advanced pelicosaurs, which became primitive therapsids, which became advanced therapsids, which became primitive cynodonts, which became intermediate cynodonts, which became advanced cynodonts. Over these hundred million years, from the late Carboniferous uh, to uh, the mid-Triassic, the primitive synapsid reptiles had evolved into the first mammals.